The following video has been rated as 15. This means that anyone seeing this message that is under the age of 15 years should click off this video now. YouTubers, this is Chewtube and welcome back to another episode of The Human Behind the Rabbit. Now before we go any further, I just want to make a very, very quick announcement. So in the last couple of days, I've recently made a Patreon and Ko-fi page. So if you want to support me, the links will be in my link tree, which is on my channel. So do check them out. Um, anyway, on to the episode. This is basically going to be a roundup of the being disabled part of this series. So, in today's episode, I'm basically going to tell you about the pros and cons of what it's like being a disabled triple threat performer like myself. So... I don't know how many people know this, but I was in a variety show a couple years back with the Isle of Wight College called The C Word, and believe me, if I could go back in time and relive a moment in my life, it would be one of those moments. However, why don't we have a look at the curtain call scene? <laughs> anything weird there? I wasn't there, was I? No, that was because I had a POTS episode, which was really annoying, and I basically had to stay behind stage. Just thinking about it now is just... Oh, it was so annoying. Like, I really wanted to go out with everyone else, but my body just said, No, fuck you, you sick man. <laughs> and, yeah, but thankfully I had support with me to basically help me get back home, because it, it was late at night, to be fair. But, yeah... Um, let's move on to the sort of good sides of it. So, I think the thing that I want to mention most of all is the fact that I, myself, and a couple of friends from my sixth form group made a show, a Christmas show, a, an original Christmas show, I'll have you know, called Canine Rescue. And... It was basically about the risks of buying pups and dogs online and not taking the time to meet the litter and the litter mates and mum as well. And also promoting rescue dogs. So I, I was basically the director, the producer, the organizer, the scriptwriter, and I acted in it. My role was sort of CEO of 
the dog shelter that was based in it. My name was Claudia Warren. And I played Spanner, Claudia's rescue dog. Yes, you were, me too. You, you, you were amazing. Like, you, you were the star of the show. Oh, stop it. <laughs> You're welcome. But yeah, the reason that I'm mentioning that is recently I've been trying to rewrite it just in case, like, we get to perform it again and I'm hoping that the notes that I make and the script that I've rewritten can be a bit more sort of professional, if that makes sense. Um, yeah, another thing that I wanted to mention was during my first year of college, in our first end of term show, I was asked to lead a dance that was shown to the class a couple weeks before. So this dance was basically taught to me by my dance teacher. Shout out to you if you're watching this video. Thank you. <laughs> um, yeah, I thought I'd show that off to you guys. Also, apologies in advance. I'm not allowed to use the original audio, so it's just going to be like NCS music over the top of it. Hope you enjoy. To wrap things up, I also managed to write and perform a song of my very own. The song was about us and her PTSD. Me too. Why did, why did you have to mention it like that? What? I'm merely stating the facts. Anyway, I. it was basically at a school concert that 
I was invited to take part in because literally everyone in the school knew that I was a pretty good singer even though I doubted myself a lot and as Me Too said the song was basically revolving the incidents that happened to me during high school and I was privileged enough to perform it in front of the one and only Rob the Bank. Here's a picture of proof. <sighs> but yeah, another thing that I'm hoping to do is to basically sort of record the song in a more sort of professional way. I have no idea if it's ever going to happen, but I'm hoping in the future that I can. If you want to watch the song, it's on my Instagram page if you scroll near to the bottom of the things that I've posted, you will find it. Um, yeah, um, I think that will wrap things up for this episode. Mewtwo, do you want to do the intro? Don't you mean outro? But yes, did you enjoy the video? If so, then I have something vital to say. Please like the video and subscribe to Chewtube's channel to see more fun videos. If you don't, I'll be used as a dog's toy. So, please like and subscribe. Do you mind sharing the video as well? Pretty please. I don't want to be sacrificed. Thank you. Honestly, I'm wondering why I'm not selling this YouTube channel to you. I mean, uh, thanks for watching. Till then, Chewtube mode out. I've been